Hi there, Jeffrey Rhodes from Experimental Homesteader, Exotic Gardening, and Sherry and Richardson.com. Uh, I am wore out. I just put another 12 hour shift in. Um, we were down two people today. Um, we've got to get some help in here. We've got to get some people trained on headsets. Um, cause everything else for the most part was running pretty smooth. Everybody, you know, there was, there was plenty of people to do all the other jobs. The problem is we have only a few people who are headset trained. And so certain jobs that require headsetting, I didn't get done on Saturday. I came in today and, you know, there was a, a friggin' disaster in the shelf area. I went ahead and knocked out the mill cart and, and finished the shelf that wasn't done on Saturday. They had plenty of people, plenty of help, plenty of time, and yet they couldn't finish the damn shelves. You know, it was a wood spin. It had to be built. Okay. Nobody else knows how to build them. That's going to be a problem. You know, and this is what happens almost every time I'm gone or, you know, I'm doing a different job. When it comes down to the spins, they don't get built because I'm not over there to build them. And... They need to, you know, somebody needs to get trained on shelves. Somebody needs to get trained on how to build the guy, the, 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 the <clears throat> spin shelves. And, you know, it just, it's frustrating because I had stuff that was left from Saturday on the back aisle. But I had to get the shelves taken care of, first thing. I got that done, got over there, and started working on the stuff that, you know, my carryover from Saturday. Um, finally got it done and started on the back aisle stuff. And it was another big day of back aisle. Um, you know, eventually at one point I did have a little bit of help from Jeff. You know, he was trying to help me with the long boards, but there's not much a second person can do if they don't really know what they're doing. You know, um, so, I mean, I tried to help him, you know, I tried to, to explain to him and, and he started doing some of it, but then he had other stuff that he, you know, he was just waiting to finish. So once, you know, once his stuff came up, you know, he finished his stuff and he was gone. So, you know, I wound up by myself again, you know. The only other person in the entire department that was still here was the supervisor. So... I left some stuff today for back aisle. I don't know whether I'm going to have to do it tomorrow. Nothing got done in shelves. None of the shelves got done. So tomorrow there is a mill cart that is three quarters full of shelves. And there's an entire day's worth of shelves to do. And they will pick, as soon as I get the carts emptied, they'll pick the next day's shelves. So there's two days worth of shelves to do tomorrow. And I'm assuming it's going to be me. I don't know who's going to do back out tomorrow, if anybody, other than the, the stuff that I left behind. I'll probably have to go over there and do that before I do all of the shelves. 
even though they'll want me to do the shelves as, as quick as possible so I can clear those carts so they can the flat stock can pick the next day. <sighs> you know, paneling didn't get done at all. And I don't know why, you know, I don't know why some of this does not get done. You know, why certain people You know, I'm just frustrated. I, I'm, and tomorrow I will be frustrated again, and I will probably be pissed off, and I will probably be, you know, ready to walk out the door. But we'll see how things go. We'll see whether I get any help, whether anybody pays any attention you know, whether I wind up being the one over there doing shelves or whether they, they actually, you know, bring somebody in to do them. Um, and I have no idea who's going to do back aisle, you know, whether it's going to be me again or whether it's going to be somebody else. But we don't have any, you know, we, we pretty much have only a couple of people who are trained on the headset. And so back aisle has to be headsetted Basically, the entire, you know, back aisle is headset. And so, they've got to do something. And they've got to do it soon. So, now I get to go to the grocery store, pick up some medicine for Sherry. And, uh, buy myself something to uh, eat for dinner um, and then try and get some food in me and uh, get to bed so I can get some sleep oh well tomorrow's another day so please subscribe give us thumbs up thumbs down comments below we will see everybody tomorrow Stay safe out there.